Okay, it's Roland from East Marsh Acres and it's uh, Sunday afternoon and I'm going to see what I can do to spread out silage tarp. So there's the one that I'm going to use for this particular area and I'm going to spread it out on this, this particular garden. Um, so we'll start at the, the um, place where we actually had the beans. So that's all the, the tea posts and the chicken wire that's in between them. And we'll spread it this way, uh, covering this entire section. It's actually a row. It's where we have the zinnias. Um, and uh, see if we can cover them over and make sure that they get uh, well draped so that uh, the zinnia or the, the grass is uh, reduced. Okay, so one bed laid to rest, working on the second one. Fun pitching practice. You got one behind you. Are we all in? Nope. There's one back here. Good try there. Okay, shall we bring the brooder out to about here? about halfway up so we can drape this over as well and then we'll put the breeder on it and then wrap it this way because the wind comes from there.
We have to take the uh, carpet out first. Okay, as I uh, suggested earlier, um, we're finished outside. Uh, I don't think I've ever showed you around my office before. Um, so given that uh, my job, uh, my, my day job uh, full time, is a uh, professor of education and computer sciences, um, this is the kind of environment that I use on a regular basis. So these three machines that you don't see are tied to computers as well. So there's computers down below. That one's not doing anything. And then there's a number of, of uh, laptops and a variety of other things, tablets. Etc. Anyways, um, so next week uh, we will be working in the garage. We have to uh, insulate um, the cold room and uh, put a uh, little uh, heat source in there so that when it does go below zero uh, for days on time, that things inside will not freeze. They'll just stay right above the freezing mark and uh, do the job that they're supposed to be doing. So we have to insulate um, two walls and the ceiling. Uh, so that should be fairly straightforward, but it'll take most of the day, I think. Um, but that's it for today. So I'm going to sign off and uh, uh, talk to you soon. Goodbye.